A terrifying example of the danger of vibration, the third longest suspension bridge in the world plunges to destruction at Tacoma in the United States. That was 14 years ago, but its lesson has never been forgotten. Today, at Teddington, scientists closely examine the effect of oscillating a model of the new Severn Bridge. Over 50 feet long, the model is being tested at the National Physical Laboratory before the actual building of the bridge can be considered. Part of a government plan to modernize road services, the bridge will cost up to 20 million pounds to build and its central span of 3,000 feet will make it the biggest in Europe. From tests carried out, scientists will overcome the danger of oscillation due to wind effects and the new bridge will be able to weather winds of over 200 miles an hour. Another factor being taken into consideration is the vibrating effect of traffic. Watch the effect of motor traffic on London's Albert Bridge. Traffic limited since 1937 to maximum five-ton vehicles. Marching, too, is a danger to bridges of this type. One near Anger in France, built like our Clifton suspension bridge, collapsed after crossing marches failed to break step. Learning from the lessons of the past, we can cross our bridges before we come to them and be safe. <laughs> 